What's going on guys? I'm Zach from the Lumios Post where we talk about all things Pokemon. And today we are talking once again about the man, the myth, the legend, the Riddler Koo. Riddler Koo, of course, if you don't know, drops a ton of Pokemon leaks. He's been doing this for a while now. So this is leaks territory. If you're not a fan of that kind of stuff, maybe hop on out of this video. Gotta give you a few seconds. Okay, you should be gone now. So, the first thing we're going to cover is this post, which has this girl singing a song, and uh, it ended up like those uh, notes, those letters are the notes to a song called The Frog's Song. It's a Japanese song or something, and uh, this girl is a character from an anime. I'm sure you guys know it. I've forgotten the name, but basically... It's this anime where people have psychic powers, and her psychic powers allow her to, like, kind of manipulate electricity, and she is obsessed with frogs. And so, this seems to be a hint at a frog Pokemon. Because of the girl's uh, electric abilities, people are assuming it's an electric-type frog. She is also a psychic, technically, so you could say psychic-electric. But all the characters in that show are psychic, so it, that may not be relevant information. But electric or electric psychic or electric something frog, it seems it will be an electric frog for sure. Maybe it'll even be involved with music since he kind of had her singing the frog song. Maybe it'll be like a frog that sings or something. You know, we've had uh, Palpitoad dealt with like vibrations and all. So maybe this one will sing. I think that would be pretty cool. I love frog Pokemon, so I'm I'm here for it. I'm really excited to see what this little guy's gonna look like. So moving on, he announced that he was going to give some information on Foy Coco on the 30th, and he did deliver. He posted this image of a crocodile with a chicken on its head, and uh, yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Uh, we can infer by this and his previous polls about Foycoco that the chicken is revealing that the hair of Foycoco will be kind of a, uh, which is like the little stem part of its design, will be uh, important as it evolves and that uh, it, it might even be like a rooster's mohawk. Maybe it'll even be feathers. I don't know. It, it, I think that's really cool. It also... The crocodile is laying down. Personally, I think that means its evolution will be quadruped. Some people have said, but the chicken is, you know, it's a two-legged animal, so it's going to be bipedal. So that, I guess, is open to interpretation. But either way, a little bit more information on that. He then posted a picture of Pseudo Wudo and said, what's its type? And the options were rock type, grass type, any type or puppy which you know it's not a type but he often uses in, in china puppy is or dog is a very uh big insult and so he often calls centro that and will because uh, they've got some beef or whatever and he very often puts that somewhere in his leaks i think it's kind of at this point his way of showing hey this post is a leak mm -hmm. so in this case it, it could mean nothing but it could also mean that, like, he's talking about a new puppy mon that disguises itself as something in a similar way that Pseudo Wudo disguises itself as a tree, even though it is actually a rock type. It, it could also be a hint to a Pseudo Wudo variant or regional fake Pseudo Wudo, which is this new concept that's coming in Scarlet and Violet. We did a video on it. If you want to check that out, uh, there's a link at, like, the top right corner of the screen so click that and uh maybe it's a hint to a regional fake pseudo wudo maybe it's a pseudo wudo evolution we don't really know much on that he then also posted and this seems to be related to uh his coin pokemon riddle his riddle about there being a coin pokemon a thing about cutting it into slices and of course he's put a dog on it and spelled out centro on the slices because Again, you know, like I said, they got some beef. So, seemingly implying that there might be a... I, I mean, since he's relating this to the coin, I'm assuming it's something to do with the coin. But a lot of people are kind of thinking it's something to do with a puppy mon. And that's like a double meeting. He's calling Centro a dog, but he's also hinting at a new dog mon. Maybe that's the case. I'm really uh, 
I I'm going to be honest. I'm kind of floored by that one. Uh, the fact that it's uh, six slices makes me wonder if it's a thing of like, because people kind of think this coin Pokemon will be a collect -em all mon where like you kind of have to collect a bunch of them some people even think you'll have to collect multiple of them to evolve it in a similar way to how meltam works in pokemon go if that's the case maybe he's revealing the number you have to catch six of them which makes sense like a party full of them and when they all level up they become one pokemon maybe i, I don't know uh, either way, he seems to be very excited about this coin Pokemon. I'm not going to lie, it's contagious. I'm starting to be very excited too for it, and I'm not a big object mon guy, so that's that's really saying something. Now, moving into some stuff that actually happened just this morning. He posted the letters P-D-Y. And uh, he said if he added the vowels, you'll know what he means. But he won't. So... We got to figure out what vowels were missing here and what that would spell. There's a lot of speculation on it. Some people are saying payday and it being something related to Meowth. Now, we have seen Cantonia Meowth in the trailer. However, again, with this whole regional fake thing, that might be something that can coexist alongside the original form of a Pokemon. So that could be what's going on here. It could be a Meowth evolution. It could be a Persian form. It, the possibilities are kind of endless, so who knows? Uh, I don't know if he'll reveal that one. Now, uh, I think the most likely thing is that it's somehow tied to a gym leader, maybe even a gym leader that uses a Persian, so a normal type gym leader, uh, because this month it's supposed to be themed around characters in the game. Uh, he does a theme for each month, and this month is characters. And since it's July 1st, I would imagine his first riddle of the month would tie to the theme, I would think. But yeah, I don't know. Uh, let me know what you guys think of this riddle. Let me know what you think of the other ones. If you can piece together any of these clues and figure it out. You know, that's why I make these videos is uh, not just to kind of cover it for those of you who may not have Twitter or may not be following Riddler Koo because he does have a private account, but also to kind of create a little comment section where we could talk about what we think about these and what we think he's hinting at here so yeah let me know your thoughts in the comments below and uh be sure to also like subscribe hit the bell for notifications when we find out what the heck this means we're gonna cover it here and we're also gonna cover official information more of coos leaks all that fun stuff so again you don't want to miss that like subscribe hit the bell until next time i will see all of you folks later